feel now that the roles have reversed going into the new season? I don't think the roles have necessarily reversed. Um, I, Angela and I have talked about this. I think we're more fire than us. Um, She's fire, I'm still fire. <laughs> <laughs> um, I enjoy it. I don't uh, necessarily think, though, that Catherine is the diabolical one. It's as much as she just snapped. Right. Um, and I still, but I think, like I just said previously, you know, letting her hair down, it's nice to be the one up for change. Because I've always kind of, you're right, been the sit back. And I, that doesn't mean it's always going to be that way, but it's finally, I'm just you know, asserting myself. And it's, uh, and even throughout the rest of the season, even, I think even you're going to see uh, with some other characters, of which I won't uh, give you the spoiler on, that, yeah, it's finally nice to be in charge. Yeah, you know, I, um, I agree. I think we're fire and ice. I don't think we've necessarily switched places where we're two different characters. Ironically, I think Veronica also snapped in a different way. Um, I don't necessarily think diabolical was the goal, but I, I do think a lot of things that happened uh, caused her to snap, and she just chose uh, to uh, snap differently. Um, but yeah, I, I, I love sort of what the characters are doing and that there is no one on Earth that uh, is so powerful that they can't be uh, sort of brought down by someone. So I enjoy that um, the character gets to have that moment of, of being afraid of someone. Um, I also, you know, I also feel that, I, I said this earlier in an interview, I feel that out of all the people on the show, that Catherine is who Veronica most wants to be. Uh, because, you know, there's nothing like old money. And Veronica's new money. So, you know, you see it all in her cars and her shoes and her clothes and all that. That's what new money does. The old money can call the judge. So, so there's, um, there's nothing like old money. And I think that's what she uh, strives for. And so that's why she admires Catherine so much.